okay now I've cleaned off uh, my stoma I always keep a couple of extra paper towels because you never know what's gonna happen I checked my skin area and I'm always itchy so it's hard to know if it's yeast or not but it have a few red spots and stuff so I'm gonna put my nystatin on I sprinkle it all over like so then I get a little paper towel and just kind of move it around it'll stick to all the areas that it needs to and I try to get most of it right around any extra like right around the stoma because that's going to be covered by the Econ seal anyway so it's just like extra protection take this all out where it's going to go for your um, sticky part and then you just brush off excess lightly All right, so that's all done. Then you open your little sting-free barrier wipe. See, it looks like it's about to blow. Whenever it opens up, I've learned something is gonna come out. And you wanna pat it down. That way you don't wipe off your powder. So you wanna pat, 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 all the way around. You can get right up on the stoma I mean, it's not going to hurt it. It's all in the same bag anyway, right? But you want to really get that covered. And then I make sure I go all the way to the edge. Without this barrier wipe, it really itches me. Because there's nothing between me and that um, adhesive. adhesive. Thank you. <laughs> I think you need to use more stuff. So, um... All right, we got that part done. Now, oh, what I forgot to mention, before you do that part, just make sure it's dry as you can get. You can get an extra bag, get your paper towels or whatever, and just fan your skin after you wiped it off to be sure it's dry. Then apply your powders and stuff, and then I just make sure this is dry. <coughs> this stuff doesn't take long to dry. See, it's already ready to go. All right, now we cover up and get ready for the bag, and I'll let you know how he gets that ready. Okay.